I was 14 years old when I started being sexually active. Um, knowing the consequences all behind it, everybody was just like, hey, you know, like, you know, it's better without a condom, this and that, right? And from there, I kind of, I was like, you know what, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give it a try, you know? But at that point, going through the state of mind, I wasn't like, hey, you know, like, this can happen, this and that, right? So I kind of faced everything sooner than what I thought. I met this girl through a friend of mine, right? And, you know, she was real cool and everything, you know? And we, we hit it off great, you know? Um, and after that, I mean, after being sexually active, everything was like, hey, you know, like, it was, it was a great feeling. So I figured, hey, you know, like, we'll be, I'll get with this girl, you know, and, you know, and we'll hit it off, right? And from there, you know, we were together for seven months. Seven months. I mean, that, to me, that's a while, you know? And, and she was just like, you know, I have something to tell you. At first, you know, I thought, she, you know, she, and she was being serious about it, but I could never take her serious because we were just, you know, always so, not down or anything, but we were happy, right? Um, and from there, she was just like, you know what? She's like, I'm pregnant. So we go in about two months into the pregnancy. Um, first month was the hardest. And everybody, little, little by little, was finding out. Moms, her, her, my girlfriend's mom, her dad, Matt, her dad, her dad wasn't even happy with me. He was just like, and I mean, it wasn't that I was a bad guy or anything, because he knew I would be the full support. He just wasn't happy on the fact that his daughter's life was I'm not gonna say ruined, but it was gonna be a, a, a bigger struggle than what it really was. And because we were so young, you know, she was 16 and I was 15, so that that right there was just like young, you know. I mean, to to everybody else, we were just kids, you know, like. Like, you know, you know, kids, you know, it's just like, hey, you know, nobody wants their kids to grow up so fast, you know. So she starts talking to me and she's just crying. Like, and I, and I, at that point, like, you know, no dad wants to think, you know, okay, my girlfriend just had a miscarriage. What to do? Because you don't think about that. You think about, man, you know, you start planning ahead, you know, I'm going to get my, I'm going to get my son or daughter this. I'm going to, I'm going to like dress her like this or whatever, you know. And after the miscarriage, the, her dad, I mean, her parents didn't care at all. And that's what hurt the hardest. It was kind of like, well, why don't you care? You know, like it's your own daughter and this and that. But they were relieved on the on the side of where they were just like, all right, cool, you're out of her life. I don't want you ever to come around this and that. But that didn't stop me. I mean, I still came around and, but they always feared like, oh, he's gonna do the same mistake. And, and like they always accused me. And I was just like, man, like, like, what did I do? Like, like, yeah, you know, this is something we did, not me as in myself, you know? Going going through, you know, the loss of my son and daughter, it, was, it wasn't easy. Um, not only did it, it help me, you know, mature faster than what I thought, but it helped me see things from a bigger perspective. And it wasn't that I'm gonna say I regretted it, because I don't. It was just one of those things that it was a life lesson. What I went through with the miscarriage and the loss was something that I would never want anybody else to go through because everything that I did was preventable. And it was a life lesson to myself because it helped me mature and it helped me see things in a bigger picture. You know, you should use protection whenever you're having sex. You know, don't think about, okay, should I wear a condom or should I not? You know, those are all things you should do. Instead of thinking about it, I mean, jump on it. I mean, you don't want to have a kid when you're so young. You want to live your life. You want to do bigger things. You want to be somebody. Then later on in the future, have kids.